since I still have a mask on my face. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today we're going to review these two portlay masks from Innisfree. Without further ado, let's get started! First, let's talk about the packaging. This is the packaging of the Innisfree portlay mask. As you can see, this is the Jeju Volcanic portlay mask and this is the Super Volcanic portlay mask. It has a similar packaging but different in color. As you can see, this has a lighter brown packaging. This is the Jeju Volcanic while the Super Volcanic has a dark packaging. Both of them has a closing lid. And has a transparent plastic to protect the product. Next, let's talk about the price. The price of both of these is that the Jeju Volcanic Pork Lay Mask is worth 720 pesos. But if you buy this at Altea website, you'll get this at only 550 pesos. Next is the Super Volcanic Pork Lay Mask. This is sold in around 780 pesos. But if you get this on Altea website, you'll get this for around 560 pesos. Next, we'll be talking about the texture of both of these. First, I'm going to apply the Super Volcanic Pore Clay Mask on this side, while this Jeju Volcanic Pore Clay Mask on this side. Actually, I really enjoyed applying this pore clay mask. This is the Super Volcanic Pore Clay Mask. It has a something grayish tone as you can see. This has a thicker consistency than the Jeju Volcanic Pore Clay Mask. Well, this is the Jeju Volcanic Pore Clay Mask. Yellow, something yellowish tone. And this is more 
ano, easy to apply than this one because since this has a thicker consistency, I'm having a hard time applying this one. Well, this Jeju Volcanic, I smoothly apply it easily on my face. Since I still have a mask on my face, I can really notice that this Super Volcanic Pore Clay Mask has a more cooling effect than the Jeju Volcanic Pore Clay Mask. As you can see, I think it is already dry up. I'm going to remove this mask. Now, let's talk about my verdict on both of these. This Jeju Volcanic Pore Clay Mask has a thinner consistency than the Super Volcanic. This is somehow some have some cooling effect and this can really tighten up my skin. While this one, this is more pricier than this one, more thicker than this one, more cooling effect than this one and um, this, is, this can also tighten up my skin. Uh, um... Actually, I'm having a hard time choosing on what on this portly mask is my number one favorite. I can say that maybe since I have a combination skin, but this is not exclusive for combination skin. This can be used from normal, combination, oily to sensitive skin. But based on my experience i can really say that this super volcanic pore clay mask really suits for oily skin since this has a thicker consistency but well this is really good but anyway my favorite on both of these is that this is my favorite the super volcanic pore clay mask since it has a more cooling effect and this can really up tighten my skin. Oh my gosh, I have a lot of... Anyway, I don't wear makeup today. But since not all products that works for me may work for you. So I highly suggest to try both of these to experience the magic of Innisfree Pore Clay Mask. If you like this video, make sure to click the thumbs up button below, subscribe to my channel, and comment anything that you want me to review, swatch, um, do some comparison, review, I guess. Thank you so much for watching. See you guys on my next video. Bye-bye!